A pleasant day to all our grade 6 students. This is your School on Air, DWNDFM, and CMD Cable Channel in Information and Communication Technology and Entrepreneurship, a component of Technology and Livelihood Education 6. We are really delighted to have you today for our discussion through our radio and telecasting mode of learning. I am Teacher Rayanan Bimamawag from the Schools Division of Hawaii. Before we start, make sure that you are in a comfortable place and you can clearly hear me in your radio and or see me in your screen. Have you taken your snacks? It is very important that your tummy is full and your body is in good condition so your mind is alert and ready to absorb and understand the lesson that we are going to discuss today. At this point, Please get your learning activity sheets for the lesson, Producing Products Based on Needs and Demands. I repeat, our lesson for today is Producing a Simple Products. Yes, you'll be producing simple products to sell based on needs and demands. Okay, go and get your learning activity sheets. At the end of the discussion, you are expected to enumerate products based on needs and demands in the community. You will be able to follow directions in producing simple products. Before you continue, please remember to do the following. 1. Read carefully and understand the directions. 2. Keep this learning activity sheet clean and do not write anything. Instead, use scratch paper for noting important details. 3. Be guided on the expected objective. 4. Be honest. Record and let your parents, guardians, check your output using the rubrics for scoring provided on the learning activity sheet. 5. If you are hard up in answering, go back to what is it and try to answer once again. You may call my phone number or chat me on Messenger after this lesson. 6. Submit a copy of your answer to your teacher on the scheduled day of your meeting. You may also send me your video of performance in producing your simple products at tryalan.mamawag at deped.gov.ph. Before we start the lesson, let's have a quick virtual tour about businesses in our community. Can you imagine the simple and huge businesses? Can you name them? Yes, you're right! It's Sorry Sorry Store. Uh-huh, correct! A computer shop. That's good! We also have the Turo Turo restaurant! Yes! Fishbowl carts and banana cube carts! We have also the malls! Very good! Yes! All around us are businesses run by groups and individuals called entrepreneur. Whether they run a small business like a Sari Sari store, or big one like computer and software company. In this lesson, you will learn to have your own small business. Starting your own business entails a serious hard work. This lesson will help you to choose what business do you like to start. It might be a good start with a hobby or interest. Remember, it is easier to work on something that you're already passionate about. This time, you can start a simple business by selling your cookies or list the products that you can sell in your community. A product is something that is manufactured following a process or grow and nurtured in order to be sold for a profit. The following are examples of simple products that are based on needs and demands. We have Yema, Polveron, Crayon Banana Pew, 
Come on the chips. Pastillas. Ice candy. Milk tea. And the diet. If you know all this, then you are now ready to start your own business. I'm going to show you and give you instructions in doing the procedures of making pulp world. Always remember that follow this procedure with the guidance of your parents or guardians. Okay, let's watch and listen to this video in making pulp world. Hi everyone! This is Donna again and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, gagawa na naman tayo ng isa na namang pangnegosyo recipe. Ito ay ang sikat na sikat na pulburon. So, ano nga ba yung mga ingredients na kakailanganin natin dito? Una, yung ating all-purpose flour or harina. And then, yung ating powdered milk, sugar, Melted butter and yung ating cellophane. Kinat ko lang siya into square pieces. And gagamit din po tayo dito ng um, balloon whisk tulad nito. And then yung ating pang mold. And then, kung gusto po ninyong maglagay ng ibang flavor dito sa ating pulboron, pwede po kayong gumamit ng nuts or cookies and cream or yung cashew. Ayan, so pwede marami pong ibang flavors. Pero yung gagawin po natin ngayon ay yung classic polvoron lang. So, ayun lang po, umpisahan na natin. So, ang first step natin guys is isasangag muna natin yung ating all-purpose flour or yung ating harina. Ang gagamitin po natin ay itong balloon whisk para talagang mahalo natin siya ng um, maayos. Ito na po yung ating sinangag na um, harina. So, ipapakita ko po sa inyo yung pagkakaiba nung hindi na sangag and itong sinangag natin. Ayan. So, ganyan po yung color nila. Ayan. And then, next po natin gagawin is isiset aside muna natin yung ating sinangag na harina. Tapos, kapag hindi na siya mainit, saka natin imimix yung iba pa nating mga ingredients. Kapag malamig na po yung ating sinangag na all-purpose flour or harina, ngayon naman po, sasalain naman natin siya para walang buo-buo.
after po nating masala yung ating harina, ilalagay naman natin yung iba pa nating mga ingredients tulad ng ating powdered milk. and yung ating sugar. And then, pag na-mix na po natin siya all together, ilalagay naman natin ngayon yung ating melted butter. Ayan, so kapag nahalo na po natin siya ng maayos at kung sa tingin po ninyo ay nag-combine na lahat ng mga ingredients natin kasama na yung butter, ngayon naman po ang next natin gagawin ay i-mold na po natin siya and i-wrap na rin natin. For more recipes, you may visit these web pages. https colon slash slash panlasapinoy.com https colon slash slash lutongbahayrecipe.com And uh, you may also surf the net for more. The answer discussion. You may check your performance by following the rubrics for scoring located at the last page of your learning activity sheets. Please answer it honestly. Answer also the reflection. This will help us to turn our next discussion and activities better. Make sure you are able to write all necessary information. If you have any question or clarification, can you write it down in your paper as well? Or you may also include your greetings or messages. To better grasp and have a deeper understanding of the lesson we have discussed, you may reread pages of your learning activity sheets. Also attached are the web pages you may visit. Our next lesson will be about online selling products based on needs and demands. 
Be sure to tune in our school on air, DWND FM, and telecast via CMB Cable Channel every Friday from 10.30 to 11 o'clock in the morning. This has been Teacher Roy Alan, your TLE ICT and Entrepreneurship Teacher for today. Always remember, it is easier to work on something that you're already passionate about. Love your work! God bless!